Hey, this is my uh, first video. Uh, my name is Rob, and uh, I'm just going to show you a quick video on how to make um, some stain for your fence or for your deck. And it's uh, completely 100% environmentally friendly, um, as far as I know, anyway. And uh, it just has basically two ingredients. Um, you'll need a measuring cup, some vinegar, and some vegetable oil. I'm using uh, some vegetable oil from uh, I found at our local Walmart. It's probably about $1.99 or $1.79 or something like that for four liters. It might have been a bit more, three liters actually, but I can't remember how much it actually costs. Um, I'm using a measuring cup here. It's a, it's a two cup measuring cup. You can't really see the numbers anymore. And I'm gonna use approximates and, uh, and pure white vinegar. I also bought it at Walmart. I believe it's around $2, I'm not sure. So, um, also, uh, one more thing I'm going to use is a paintbrush, and I should also add in a whisk. I can find one here. I will look for one, and I will find it, and I will, uh, I'll show you what whisk I use. But you can use a fork, a spoon, it doesn't really matter what you use. But anyway, you're going to use uh, three parts of the oil. So, I usually like to put the oil in first. So, let's watch me pour this in here. Foster. So again, this is a pretty much approximate. It's three parts to one part. So I'm going to use about one part vinegar. I use a little bit less vinegar, and you'll see why at the end of this video, or near the end of this video, because you um, kind of near the end of the mixture, I find that the vinegar stays, and the uh, the oil doesn't. It kind of gets used first. So. And it's just I find you don't need that much vinegar. There we go, that's vinegar. One more. There we go. Okay, so that's good for our mixture. And we really gotta stir it up really good. Now let's see if I can find that. So I found my whisk. There it is. Just gonna stir it up really well. So I'm, I'm gonna fast forward this for you, but it usually takes about maybe depending on how vigorously you do and you're going to want to stir um, as you're applying so while you're applying it to your fence or your deck every once in a while I like to give it a good stir um, where I live. Um, but I kind of want to show you the, the fence that I've already done before it starts raining um, so let me go do that now alright so as you can see here this is the, uh, the fence that I've done Let's see, I started here about, say to this about three weeks ago now, this section here. And then the next section I did about maybe a week before that, and then a couple weeks before that. And then the very early spring, I think I did this, this section right about here, which is a little bit later. And then uh, the rest of this stuff here, as you can see along here. So that's about one year in. Oh, let's see. I'm sorry. One year in here, and you can see the color. I'm just gonna quickly show you this. Maybe I can do it like a side by side. But this is a section that hasn't been done at all. You can see the color difference. It's kind of gray. Let's get a better shot of that. Yeah, you can see the difference there. And I find it's like I said. I started. Uh, I don't know if you can see from here kind of the section that I've done so far, the sections I haven't done all the way to the end. You can definitely kind of see how it does last pretty well, um, or it does, does last pretty good. I've been having an issue with uh, some kind of wood boring wasp that kind of uh, has been eating the, uh, I don't know if you can see that, let's see if I can show you that, has been eating the, uh, the wood. But since I've, I've done this, he hasn't been doing, he hasn't been back to do that, so. Um, I was worried about, like, insects eating the actual, the oil, or being attracted to it, but that hasn't happened. And uh, it's definitely protecting the wood, like, you can feel that it's still got an oily feel to it. And I just, it's it's kind of comparable to, like, a Thompson's water seal. It does have a little, add a little color, though. As you can see, it's a little bit darker. Um, definitely, I'll uh, show you one more time the difference between the two. It's kind of like a Thompson's water seal, but definitely less expensive and uh, there's no harmful 
harmful chemicals. I'm just going to show you how it uh, how it applies on here, um, so you can kind of get an idea of um, how it's going to apply. So if you can see, uh, let's see if you can see this. Right, so it goes on, kind of like any other stain. This is obviously not the wipe at all. But it goes. I mean, so I'll show you this one more time. A section about this much here. This whole bottle here will do a section of fence. So approximately an eight foot section of fence, just under eight feet. So maybe maybe seven and a half feet will do. Sometimes I run out, sometimes I have a little bit left over. So anyway, thanks.